Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today's video, we're going to be talking about the 300 kVA transformer we're having installed. This is a residential area here. We're doing a GPU farm on 300 kVA, 3080s, 3090s, and 3080 Ti's. So we got the cement here poured. The uh, copper has already been pulled from the electric poles. So they're going to come out of these pipes here, this one here, these three over there. So we're pulling three phases, uh, 231 volts, and 300 kVA transformer. Over here, on this side, is where the gear is going to be, somewhere around here. So that gear is going to hold all of our breakers for the 300 kVA. So multiple panels coming in, and uh, that's going to power our setup. So I'm going to go over there show you guys you see it's pulled underground here you can imagine the copper being pulled underground all the way to these pipes over here and so they're gonna then go into the wall and power the panels on the opposite side so we've got a couple of pipes coming in 600 amp panels and so it's going to be pulled on this side panels installed probably between or just not between they're not going to fit between these two by fours but placed onto the wall here and then the conduits are going to be pulled on top of the trusses and then a hole in through the side here and then it's going to be pulled through the top going all the way across all the trusses and then it's going to get pulled down the bottom here and you'll have an outlet right here. So the outlets will come here, and then the outlets is gonna feed the racks. Here's our rack placement. Put some tape here, got some permanent marker, you know, figured out um, how many watts each rack's gonna be using, you know, how many racks we need, all that stuff, for the 300 kVA. And so we needed to have the tape and the permanent marker to get our adjustments here. But at 300 kVA, we're gonna be running 60 racks here. You can see some of the drawings we have here, little round drawings for all the racks. And uh, exhaust going to be on that side, and the intake on this side. We're going to use the same type of fans we used at our other locations. These are our 48 inch, uh, 22 uh, uh, CFM fans, 23,000 CFM fans. We're going to have two of them pushed to the top and blowing out all the hot air. So that's how we're going to build this out. Now in terms of exhaust, we're gonna have also two fans placed at the top, blowing out or a little bit, not to the very, very top, but mostly to the top, blowing out the hot air. So this is gonna be producing 60, 60 rigs um, at 3,700 watts, so it's about 220,000, I think, watts. Um, and so we have to blow all that hot air out of here. Right now, we didn't have enough room in there to actually use all 300 kVA. As you can see, we ran out of room. We need to have some walking room here so we can walk through that door, walk around the edge, and then walk between all the rigs. So we had to transfer some of our rigs into this container here. So this container already has six rigs and uh, we need to have it hold 20. So we're gonna double stack two sides in there of, of racks, uh, five rigs a rack. So it's gonna be five, 10, 15, 20. So I have 20 rigs in there, and then I'm gonna have 60 in there. So it's gonna be 80 rigs once it's all filled up. So it'll take a decent amount of time. And I wanted to show you guys the current progress for this build out. Again, showing you guys that platform here for the 300 kVA and you get an idea of how that's built out all right well i hope you guys like the video you know what to do hit like subscribe with the bell check out crypto llc.org if you're looking for someone to help you build out a asic or a gpu mining farm go to crypto llc.org for that and check out our other social media accounts like parlor gab mines bitshoot rumble and of course youtube and until next time bye